Good evening to you once again if you just joined us. Welcome to the Up and Live show again if you're streaming with us via YouTube, via Facebook, via Instagram, via the World Wide Web. It's also we're on TGM Radio. That's what UK. I'm just getting used to the TGM Radio website. You know, we don't really use it as, as much. Facebook, though. nah, nah, nah. Yeah. Do, yeah. Of course. That's right. something there. So um, we, we're going across the Atlantic right now. Um, we've been having guests from all around the world. We're blessed and we're grateful for that. And we have another gentleman here with us this evening. He goes by the name of Sean Damte. I hope I get it right. He has lovely merch. You see my hat? Yeah. Welcome to the show, sir. <laughs> Good evening and thank you for joining us this evening. How are you doing? I'm okay, boss. My pleasure. My pleasure being here, man. Thanks for having me. Of course. It's a joy. It's a joy. It's a joy. Uh, if you could just tell us quickly, um, who is Sean Damte? Awuda. Yeah, um, Sean Damte, man. Um, I'm a Nigerian-born artist. Um, living in London currently. But um, I'm into Afro B, Afro dance, all Afro fusion. And um, grew up mostly in Nigeria. Um, spent some time outside of Nigeria. But um, now I stay in the UK, love in London. Um, travel every way if i have to just to get this music going you know okay um so, so tell us a little bit about um dance outside of it because you know we we were dance i'll be a show and obviously i've never been to nigeria yeah, yeah, yeah. i heard a lot about it mm -hmm. i have loads of nigerian friends yeah how is what's how is dance all in nigeria talk to me how is it going it's big you know it's big um you have some artists um that's all they do you know um in dance hall space um they give you that kind of dance or feeling like you feel like you're from you're, you're in Jamaica sometimes <laughs> and sometimes myself yeah, yeah, I yeah. kind of wonder like how do they learn this lingo mm. and all of that but I mean it's it's quite big it's, I don't know if you know Pato Rankin on the show. yeah yeah, yeah I heard know I'm saying <laughs> so as one of the big um artists there will do dance all and so yeah I mean that gives the vibe there are loads of them that do it um someone like myself I just try to tip my toes in it i'm not mm. gonna say i put everything in because i tip my toes in it because i just yeah. I like that vibe and that feeling it gives and so i try to merge that with my music and that's where i find myself i realized that uh so you're living in here in london right yeah 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 i, I realized that your music is like the the Afrobeats that's in the uk at the moment like mm. the, the london bass sound it has that sound yeah however i heard a little bit of a dance with it yeah Tell us, um, was, is it strategic for you trying to do dancehall based in UK? Do you find it has a, a hindrance to get the music to connect to the audience that you're really looking for? Um, I'm not going to say there's an hindrance, to be honest, because it's music is universal as well. Why you can go online, you, mm. know, you get people. Um, my, my music, like you just mentioned, I found I, I like dancehall. You know, I like I can't I can't speak patwa as much as I would want to. Can I practice. can't even speak it. Let me put it that way. <laughs> you can't but, understand it. <laughs> But um, I try I try to find those words. Mm. Sometimes just you know one two three words and mm. then just try to make it that way. And then living in the UK kind of like affects just like you said the sound, the music itself. And mm. um, I'm originally from Nigeria, hundred percent. You know, Lagos boy. So um, <laughs> yeah, I can't I can't let that part of me leave. Do, do, so. do you think the dance our culture and the the African culture, especially the Nigerian yeah. culture, do you think it's similar in any shape or kind? um it's funny uh the for honest truth is it is the same rhythm let me put it that way yeah so and i tried to call my my kind of rhythm i call it afro calypso because mm, okay i see it's that's the a, same that's a new one yeah <laughs> yeah so i see it's the same rhythm mm. it's just the way you deliver it you know and then the way you make people um vibe to it so for and the culture is blending when i mean blending like so after time sometimes like i said you won't even know if this is a nigerian mm. or Afrobeat artists singing mm. or is it jamaican and then there's big artists like cranium zimovado i can mention names yeah that oh, we all listen to what i was referring in in terms of people yeah all people connect and all people operate mm -hmm. do you think we are similar in terms of our culture 100 percent, because um yeah 100 percent. i i, I want to say no but i have to say yes because there's that kind of music that brings out that part of you that that, that i call it the roots the mm. african roots in you that's the kind of music so when it comes to that culture it's the same thing um food wise is almost the same thing mm. um maybe nigerians or africans some of them like pepper no, no, jamaicans <laughs> like pepper as well but y'all exactly. just take it to another <laughs> level bro so i could get it get, get it straight nigerian food or jamaican food which one mm. which one better Sorry, let me ref let me like, can I rephrase <laughs> that question. Should I say it in English so you can understand? Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe. Uh, Jamaican food <laughs> mm. uh, versus Nigerian food. Which one do you think is better? 
Depends on what food, man. I love curry goat, you know. So yeah, I see <laughs> one for Jamaica. But, so you, you know, you, but, but then you mix jollof fries and curry goat. Ooh, you see where yes, I'm coming from? That's, that's nice. That's nice. <laughs> so, that's nice um, for real. So um, where 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 a lot of people get it twisted? Like um, mm. a lot of things that we do in Jamaica. No, it's come from our four from parents from yeah. Africa. Yeah. And um, I think we have a very strong Afri- um Nigerian descendant in us mm-hmm. because mm-hmm. I I guess like some of the people in th- in the dance hall scene yeah they're like the regular people in Nigeria we're loud we're flashy yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. you definitely know a Jamaica or a Nigerian when you see them, them. <laughs> we're flashy we're loud that's I think Jamaicans the Jamaicans came from Nigeria most of, yeah, Jamaican most came of from us Niger- it, it said in the history books <laughs> okay it's right because there is two countries that is very Ghana similar and, Ghana and Nigeria and Nigeria mm. and I, I hope you don't take it offensive because mm. I have a few Ghanaian friends and a few Nigerian friends. They hate each and other. And they don't like they don't. each what, other. What, what, why? What? Why? Can you, can you? I'm glad that someone is here from the culture. Can you explain that situation for us, please? Uh, but I don't, I don't, I wouldn't say Nigerians and Ghanaians don't like each other. Who and who it's don't just, like who? It's, it's, it's this way. It's like having a child and two of them you know they're yeah. close in age yeah they will always have to squabble so it's sibling, yeah, sibling, sibling, rivalry. sibling rivalry that's what it is about it like this you know the music is almost the same some sounds i think it's a culture clash you know <laughs> yeah, th- yeah so <laughs> because in, in, in like we almost have that with like, trini you see yeah. but uh, uh, just because we are you're way bigger we are, we are more dominant yeah, exactly yeah, but we almost have that but anytime i get trini did and people yeah. Yeah. trini daddy and i should say yeah they always have that little opposition you know? towards the Jamaican and we've seen culture. it on the legal scene as well where <laughs> exactly. the, yeah. the whole fl- anyway yeah. Yeah. So right. yeah so that's what it is really so I'm um, moving on to deeper things in regards to your music deeper you <laughs> have been in music for how long I mean that's gonna have me go back years but I've been I'm, I'm what they call an OG in Nigerian music business you know because okay um, um, yes, my, that's my, what I was told. Yeah, so yeah, um, um, my first single was in 1999. You get me? 99. Yeah, that was a long time that ago. Was a long time ago. I was a child. Ago. You see what I'm saying? I was a baby. <laughs> so that was my first single was 1999. But um, then I took a big break. When I'm in a big break, so after that, um, 1999, I mm-hmm. never got back into. It. I was young. I think I was about 16 there about. Okay. So I never got back into the studio until about 2000. And, 2006 I was think. there a specific reason for that break um yeah i moved over to america yeah okay. so um so living out there the, it was kind of different the culture mm. for me like i had a culture shock like mm. i said and so i couldn't really adjust adjust mm. quickly as much as i would love to mm. so but when i moved back to nigeria mm-hmm. then um i had to do music again okay. was, like i said to 20, 2006 right so and then um i did that for like three years okay so in 2009 um i quit again um <laughs> What? I stopped. So why is this key what, what, ch- chopping this? and changing? Yes. Why, why? What's happening? Do we need to speak? <laughs> no, no. Because <laughs> see, and and that's the beauty of life. You mm. need to you need to understand. It's it's called like the gambler. You need to understand when to start, stop. You know, you know when to play your hands. Mm, yeah. mm. Um, I knew what I was doing, but I didn't have anything to offer. It's oh, okay. different, you know. It's, yeah. it's yeah. just it doesn't matter what you, who you are. If you don't have anything to offer, there's nothing. It's just so but yeah. So um in twenty sixteen, mm-hmm. yeah, I believe. So I came back again twenty sixteen as a third time. So mm-hmm. hopefully it's third time lucky. <laughs> yeah. So um, I came back twenty sixteen again and then since then I've been like, you know what? If I'm keep living and coming back, why just not stay? Just stay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and just get this thing done. So that's so, what I've been doing it. So so let's jump from twenty sixteen to yeah. twenty eighteen mm. when you dropped the What's that? Was that your Awuda, first EP? Awuda Begins EP. Awuda Begins. Yeah, yeah. Explain the title of that EP and the reasoning behind. Wow. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 <laughs> you have to go deep today. Okay, okay. The, 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 ti- the reasoning behind the title yes. and the reasoning for doing that EP. Already? Already. So, yes. it's, it brings back to the concept of Awuda, you know, because even when you hear me on my song, I start yeah. with Awuda. Yeah, that's so why I wanted ex- to explain <laughs> what Awuda is. What, is what, Awuda? What, what, what does that mean? So, for me, Awuda is that feeling you get when you, you made it, you're here, you know, when people see you. and Accomplishment. Like, accomplishment uh, kind of thing. Okay. And that okay. feeling. So, um, and for me now, it's become a form of greeting. It's mm. become a form of um, association and a form of belief. Mm. So, um and that's where that came from. So the Awuda Begins for me was just, you know what, guys, um, I'm ready to take you all on a journey. Yeah. So right. we're starting now. Yeah. Like, this is Awuda Begins. 
you, you don't everybody wants to live forever but you have to die sometimes. yeah so yeah, that's true so that's how it is that's so it true. begins so, so you have to just roll with it so, so. um let me just ask you J- yeah. Just to make things clear, yeah, yeah. is Awuba one of those language in Nigeria and does that mean something or it's just oh, your it? word? It's 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 technically see that's what that's a good question. It's technically <laughs> have Jamaican, half Yoruba. So no, you're gonna have to I'm, explain I'm that. explaining that. So right. I used to hear these words like Awudat, you know. Okay. Oh, this is where I'm coming from. <laughs> okay, okay. Now, okay. All right. Now, okay. now okay. it makes sense. Now the Yoruba people be like da who da as it tanya who be that you know okay so, like, okay that. so that, that's all african that, 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 that's all most people yeah, 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 yeah. like exactly. yeah. like who so, be that who be that who be that going so because, yeah okay. when and then jack like i said because i keep coming and leaving people keep asking who's this who that, who be that? and then i'm like you know i would it's me yeah i'm here so now. this is where the beginning exactly. starts that was in 2018 yeah, yeah, yeah. and how yeah. was the reception for that ep and the performances from that ep how was that for you um the EP did quite well, quite strongly, I should say. I think it had um the first three months over a hundred thousand streams, I believe. Wow. It did quite well. Mm-hmm. Um, but when I say but is I expected more because I give myself I felt like, you know, because I look at myself I'm like one of the like I said, oh Jesus. You of have music. yeah, you I've have done. Here. You I've have put in your work. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But so I was expecting a million streams and mm. all that, but it didn't happen, but that's fine. But <laughs> <laughs> But before yeah, how how did that feel for you? Because you you've done I would have begins. Yeah. You set this expectation. Yeah. How? What lesson did you learn from that, or how did that feel? Um, that's a good one, like, cause um, it has just brought me to that stage where I believe I have to run my own race. You mm-hmm. know, I have to be my own person, do and, my own music, and not compare I to anyone compare, else. Compare, compete right, with anyone. Right. Right. You know? So I just put the music out there. People love it. They love it. I'm, there's no two ways. You have to love my music. Exactly. If you, if you don't love my music, you're then. missing something. <laughs> <laughs> Right, let's, and, and let's speak about this quickly. Like, yeah, yeah. I know you're you guys in Nigeria, you're very influenced by dancehall music. Mm. Mm. If you have to have one color, who would that color be with in dancehall music? Yeah, <laughs> man, I'll go with vibes all day. Is it? I want to roll with vibes, man. Speak yeah. it into yeah. existence, you yeah. never yeah. know. Yes. That's, you you that's see what's happening. Man, you know? I mean, even though he's behind bars, he's nah, making strides. Make, yeah. We're not making anything stop it's, us. It's not, I mean, I'm, I'm, we're not here to judge anyone for no, whatever. No, 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 so definitely not. I would want to fuck with him. Yeah. That's just the yeah. truth, because I yeah. love his kind of music. Yeah. I love the vibes he gives and mm, mm. like that. So that's that's my number one, no doubt. Cool, no man. Okay. So we move from... I would have begin to I would have rising man like Sean Damte. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Talk to us about that one though, because that one is your sophomore, um, yeah, sophomore, sophomore EP, EP yeah. which has been making strides, yeah, even though yeah. it's just what yeah. over. Is, is it? Three o- weeks there about. Oh, but yeah. Yeah. yeah, August 2020. It's doing yeah. very well. Talk August to us about that. Yeah. So um, yeah, it's just like you said, it's a sophomore. It's just the, mm. the story continues really. Mm. So we came from I would have begin. So to the rising. I the rising. Mm. And, um, you know, um, to every beginning, sometimes they say there must be an end. Yeah. And when something seems to want to end, the only way a candle going off, you have to light it. Press the gas. You know, press the gas mm. on it. So I'm like, yo, I'm not getting tired. I'm just about to start. Okay. I'm rising. Okay. And that's where when you look at the way I arranged the EP to mm. kind of say set the same tone and the story. precedent right right you know, um, i started off with the first track um mm. prayer you know yeah everything in life yeah you know, pray about it yeah and then i went to my track two which is man like sean Dampton, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Just telling everyone it's just money on my mind That's always the next you know? one. right <laughs> so money on my mind always because mm. you know then from there like you have this money now what do you do you just want to party with it you know? mm, just, yeah. that's what that's what like, we all mm, do. Yeah. Right. so that got me to tra- track three which is quick 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 means come and get the quick quick come and live this life come, oh, okay come flex the muscles with me mm. and then from there i went to the fourth verse which is the fourth track i mean mm-hmm. marcelina mm-hmm. and marcelina you see it has that dance that afro Caribbean Vibe, vibes to right. it. So, and what I'm saying here is, okay, the money's here, we're partying, and then Marcelina, come, enjoy, come, yeah. come, 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 come enjoy this yeah, life, come yeah. see what we're doing. Yeah. And from there, I moved on to, um, I believe, from Marcelina, then I moved on to o- Opo. No, um, before Opo, there was this track there. Mm. Track number five is called, I can't remember the top of my head. Don't worry. But that set the tone for my last track, which mm-hmm. was Opo. And Opo for me was like, everything now, we have it abundance mm. the money the mm. girls the everything so mm. it's important it's stone, you know <laughs> so, <laughs> so uh, the story I, just keeps going um i don't want to be a party pooper but, but do you mm. think 
life is just for living you only live once all of that jazz but is there nothing is wrong with the picture you're painting but do you think that there is something wrong with the picture you painted if you get do you understand the question i'm asking yeah um right. and that yeah I, I see i see that point and and i'm a spiritual person okay and people I, people call me new black jesus you know and um that's because they feel like i would do for others before i do for myself okay and that's the kind of person i am okay um i i look at life i'm not trying to be so deep because after time when you when you're so educated you read too i read i've read you too read much deeply. books mm. i've read the bible mm. about like two million times mm. i'm a little bit exaggeration yeah, 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 yeah definitely and i've read other books but my point is um at the end of the day if there's no money it doesn't make sense no way you, you want need, to look that's at that's resources it. that you need that's no way you want to look at it because mm. at the end of the day you can claim to be happy mm -hmm. but if you cannot afford the little things you want there's nothing you can do you're going to be sad regardless because you don't want to see your little one calling up to daddy daddy i need this daddy i want that and then you cannot afford it yeah the temptation might be there mm. but just you you got to keep working hard true but there are persons who would look at it from the perspective that money isn't everything i'm not bash i'm not nah, bashing nah, I'm the fact that you. people need you. You, get, you get what i'm, I'm saying to people you. need money mm. to enjoy the finer things in life mm. but there are persons who look at it from the perspective that listen yeah i have my family look at look at the pandemic that is happening yeah yeah i have my family i can make ends meet it might mm. it might be hard to make those ends meet yeah. but i have my family i can pay my bills my children are here so basically you're saying you're content with your living and yeah with like so people might look yeah, at yeah. it from a, 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 a different content. perspective yeah yeah but one. there's also nothing wrong with looking at it from that no nah, no nah, i mean good good um life. i have a song think i have a song called life More yeah happiness mm -hmm, you know? mm -hmm. yeah. the f most important thing is life mm -hmm. yes the most important thing is life yep now some people tell me happiness comes before money and some people tell me money before happiness but, but money brings but, happiness as well but it's down to the person for their it's, it's interpretation personal, right exactly. it's so down to them. it's personal mm. like some people will choose money before happiness some mm. feel my money will get me happiness so you can you can arrange that every how you how want it suits you. but the first right. thing is just like you said is life and mm. regardless life when you have life life with your family mm. your having life is good health yes having life is being able to do what you want to do how and you want to do it gives you the you motivation know, you to that do to something wake else up, you right know, having that life right. and that's what it, that life money happiness is about so when we say money is important is mm. even when we die they still need money to bury us that's true <laughs> exactly <laughs> point take it that's true money. point um, take it let's let's jump off the topic of money yeah yeah so we know who you are now mm-hmm we we'll see the, the merchandise mm -hmm. and everything yeah. Yeah. we're gonna what just show what inspire you to be the artist who you are today or mm. somebody has seen the game that make you who you are yeah yeah um funny like i'm not i'm not i'm a very straightforward person i'm not gonna lie yeah I, aside when i started like i said earlier that i didn't have anything to offer yeah, mm. yeah. so you took that pause i took that pause because mm. i've always had this beard since i was young but i never knew how to grow it Ah. you get me and um for every musician you need to have what they call a brand yeah yeah no matter what mm. people should be able to identify you mm. in, without you having to say to say, to say you mm. know so so um and when i started growing the beard people were like oh you look like rick ross and stuff like that yeah so and this is this is so funny <laughs> so when i came back into the music the third time mm -hmm. the first thing i did was a remix of like a boss rick ross's ah. like a boss, yeah. so it's out there on youtube mm. so I did the remix and then people liked it. I was rapping in there though. I wasn't okay. singing. Versatility. Yeah, people liked it. So I'm like, you know what, man? I think, yeah, I got what people mm. want to hear now. <laughs> so then I realized, no, it's not just your voice no more, man. People mm. like this beard. The people image. like this. It's a look. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's an image, right? Saying, yeah. So we have something to sell right, right now. So right. we yeah. have to sell it. Because right. it does it does look, I like the imagery and I it do looks like sharp it. and it, it looks presentable. It reminds it me yeah. of Big Joe. Me? No, no, Big oh, Joe bo Box Juice. Look at that one. Look, it looks. Look, it looks like Big Joe box juice. No, so there's no. a there's a so there's a famous there's drink. a box drink yeah. in Jamaica. In Jamaica, yeah, yeah. the brand is called Big Joe. Mm. And Google. that's how it looks. It look that like it. look like Big Joe. Uh, Big, Joe man, need, Big Joe needs to come. Let's talk. Yeah. Yeah. We, need, we need to talk. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know, we need to sign some sponsorship yeah. deal. Just like our colonel, just like our KFC have the colonel. Yeah, you look yeah. like the box drinks. Yeah. Yeah. Big, Big Joe. Joe. Uh, it does yeah. look like Big Joe. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Where oh, is it? Nice. I'll find I'll, it. Okay, cool. Later. But let me see that. That's yeah. right. We'll show it to you later when I find nice. it. Right. Brilliant. So I'm. Um, 
The merch looks really good. I don't. Thank Uncle you. Ives, beg your camera one now, please. Yeah, give. Uncle me. Ives, beg, beg your camera, please. please. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. Jesus, you're so aggressive. Oh, Mighty God, straight by this way, I do tonight. Okay, Ivan, give us a camera, please. <laughs> Um, I give me my, give me my so, one. Yes. Yeah, see that, let's see let's see do that, a see camera that, change. So yes, basically, this that. merch is available. Yes, 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 yes. Where can we find? Where can we find? Sorry, serious talking. Sorry, serious. <laughs> um, where can we find your merchandise? Yeah, um, on my website, shondante.com. Right. Um, yeah, you and find we find the, the hats. We find the hat, guys. Hat. Where are smokers? Where's the? I, smoke? I, 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 I saw the, the smokers there. We've got you covered. We've got your result. This is. Life, money, and happiness. So if you smoke this awuda, you're going to get life. You're going to get money. money you're really happy for And you know what? I'm actually really impressed with this. And he's I'm contemplating very smoking now. <laughs> impressed with this. You know what's like, as you know that we are going to take one of them. We are well one. Jack and all the next. You know. <laughs> next and I'll keep you know, mine yeah, yeah. just for souvenir because you know. I ain't no smoker. Uh -huh. Right. Um, but but trust me, we love your music. Yeah. We were I big up to Paris, that. by the way. Paris, anywhere anywhere that yeah, you yep. are at the moment big of yourself to stream yep. um shout out to paris right yep. shout out to paris um very hard working uh, and very persistent she's very persistent <laughs> big that. of yourself i, I like love that, that about you. <laughs> yeah. um so we have the sophomore album that was dropped in august 2020 obviously based on corona a mm -hmm. lot of bookings were impacted yeah but what have you been working on during this time as in booking well it's kind of hard to yeah, say, no, you say but, but it's kind of hard to say i have so much music right now like like i said i've been working on music mm -hmm. music i have so much music right now like i just want to drop a song every week i'm not i'm not kidding i'm not kidding and they won't let me because they keep telling me you're gonna sex so, uh, people get tired of your music i'm like let them get tired man and and this is passion. This it. is the passion. Yeah. This is you can see it. Yeah. You can see the passion for the music he has. Yes. You can see the passion he has for the music. Um, and I, I guess whoever is around you has good advice. <laughs> but we want to hear more music. You know, of you course. Understand? Let you us, let, know. let us get used to Awuda arising. Yes, yes, the yes. The man called Sham Dante. Yeah, 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 you yeah. understand? Yeah, All right, you know yeah. what I'm going on. Mm. Yes, this is the part. Yes. Where dun, dun. I like. Talk to me. Okay. Dragon All Star. What's but, going on? Right. What's so, going on? We're, we're <laughs> You're about to find out. It's going to be a bit difficult today because I don't know if Dragon will go over the Atlantic or I'm going to stay over full side. It doesn't oh, matter. Sorry. You know why? Because yeah. he's Rick, a very. Yeah. Introduce this part because I um, <laughs> feel like more at the inner cross. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're welcome. So, people, right now, right now, on center stage, we mm. bring to you from all the way from the southern continent of the world. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> live here in the UK, in Europe City. This is the number one choice for your freestyle on the radio. Woo! Dante! <laughs> okay. Yeah. They wanna love me like yeah, yeah. They wanna hold me like they, they. But they won't want me like they, they. But they don't know who I be. I woulda, yeah. Money in my mind, no way. Yeah. I never stop it. I'm a one day, yeah. Monday run me to the Sunday, yeah. They keep me rolling on the cool day. Yeah, me a chillin' in the TV and yeah, my radio in the UK and we ballin' and we chillin' and we rollin' and we say we not for fallin' Couple live show is the place that we chillin' and you know how we do we wanna rub it They wanna lock me like yeah, yeah They wanna lock me like yeah, yeah But me I know they complain, yeah Then me I know they complain, yeah, yeah so we roll up on the street and uh, they feel the vibe and uh, they wanna hear me throw the spooky on the right and uh, oh, you brought a stake and uh, and you look and uh, yeah 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 So me playing on a day all day They wanna feel it on a sing my way So shorty make you come my way Let me show you what a daddy gonna do They wanna love me like Are you And they feel it on the vibe Yeah 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 all right. Mm. Another one? Yeah. Okay. All right, we're going to dance our style. Are you oh, ready? Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh
People Sean Dante live here in the Open Live Show, you know? This one is for the ladies. <laughs> Alright, let's go. See your body, they make me the ginger. They didn't fall up my tinder. Say I they feel like Matilda. My Selena can make you be the binda. Oh, I know we jump down. No. You don't be brown binda. Say your body's in the inna. Say no. I know be Django. I know go rango. Say your body's in the inna. Yeah. Me and walking on a brown line Like you and I feel it on the vibe and wanna stroll line On the moonlight, chilling on the bad side Holding on the stroll line I'm the one that you need, girl I'm the one that you want, girl I'm the one that you're gonna make you want That you're gonna make you scream, yeah, 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 yeah. My body won't, baby, my body won't My body won't Keep my cup for me, body won't Live yeah, Aouda. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Grab my chilling and they're rustling and they're selling and yeah. they're roping on the selling. Wanna hear me go kill it. Uh, you know they play with the rope of the vibe, with the drop of the side and the feel of the fire. Yeah. And that boy with the pose, with the form, with the make money, they go like say they're free, so they come, huh? No, they vex, no, they pose, we just they pose with the dip or take the cake, some they pray, they call the show, yeah. Shine that chains on my neck, the ones in my ear, of the ones that I've got in my eyes, don't you wanna stare? Don't worry, how we do. That money just to make the money, they got a plan. I realize he's a freestyler, though. No. I realize he's a freestyler. I realize he's a freestyler. You know, be taking away, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yanga, you can hate on me, Yanga. I go the count money, Yanga. Say, so, say, so, no worry, Yanga. You can hate on me, Yanga. I go the count money, Yanga. Say, so, say, so, no worry, Yanga. No worry, yeah, 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 yeah. Shout out to Paris, shout out to TGM Radio. Awuda, awuda. The Open Life Show, uh huh. All right, we're, we're going to give you the, the, the Awuda yeah. the yard style, right? Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I'm going to give you the yard style, uh, you say it, yeah? Let me see what I'm going to do. Uh. So, all right, see if you say it at Jamaican. Yeah, yeah. Wait, you have to say, Awuda! Awuda! Yes, yeah, that. yeah. Awuda! <laughs> all right, I eat that. We like the idea. Yeah, yeah. We're well, going to run with it, you know. <laughs> People, remember the merch, you know? Remember the merch, remember the merch. Yes, please. Stay yes, humble. Please. Life, money, happiness. All day. And it's all courtesy of Sean Damte live in the studio. People, it's, it was a joy having you here. Yeah, man, same here, man. Thanks for having me, man. Really appreciate it. Shout out to everyone, man. Keep chilling, keep listening to TGM Radio. Yep. The Open Life Show. Every Tuesday, 9 to 11. Don't forget, man. Check them out. And don't oh. forget to Google your boy. Some socials, some socials. Oh, yeah. Um, social media is Sean Damte everywhere, man. It's S for Sugar, E for Echo, A for Alpha, N for November, D for Delta, A for Alpha, M for Mama, P for Papa, T for Tango, E again for Echo. Wait, you did it wrong. A is for Awuda. We talking about and, uh, Alpha. You, you got it wrong, bro. I, I, I can't put in the Awuda because some people start googling that. I'm like, you know, okay. Well, okay. <laughs> my okay. teacher didn't teach me that in school. <laughs> <school. laughs> okay, I get you. Well, thank you ever so much for passing through. Man, it's been a pleasure. Um, we here. love the work pleasure. that you're doing. Continue to keep thank it you up. Very, very much. We're looking right. for after sophomore is Junior, though. Looking yeah, for yeah, Junior, I, Junior yes. EV. Or when, when are we doing the album? Now you. See, I have you have a song coming this Friday. Okay. You have another song coming next Friday. Okay. And then so you have another song coming at the Friday after the next. And then okay. you have another one after Friday after the next. After so he's next going after to be bombarding us yeah, with, yeah, yeah. with wicked tracks. Wicked tracks all day. It's Friday. Then. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Of course. Big up yourself, Sean. Yes, all yes, the very yes. best. Yeah? Thanks for having me. No man. problem. Of course. Take care. Yeah. People, and uh, it's a pleasure, people. I would tell us that. Uh, 